Hi, welcome to this video of prior cases in cardiology related to incidental aortic masses in the preoperative assessment presented by Dr. Kaslim. Please like and subscribe to support us. Let's start with this case of a man of 72 years old who has antecedents of subtotal gastrectomy for early gastric cancer more than 10 years before hypertension, diabetes, he had a left knee pain for a week and a mass lesion on the left proximal tibia. So he had a preoperative evaluation for excisional biopsy. On echocardiography, there was a normal function and morphology of the left ventricle and a normal valvular function and a mass lesion that fills the ascending aorta on the suprastandard notch view. This is the image of transthoracic echocardiography. There was a hypoechoic mass lesion that fills the ascending aorta, well seen by color flow Doppler. Is it a thrombus or a tumor? The patient was treated by anticoagulation. In this situation, the optimal duration of anticoagulation is not well known. The patient had also a scan with injection of contrast, but there was no contrast enhancement of this lesion. He had the biopsy of the knee, which was a sarcoma. After one week of anticoagulation, there was no change in the size of the aortic lesion. The PET scan showed uneven glucose uptake in the ascending aorta, suggesting inflammatory plaque or malignant lesion, and a hypermetabolic mass lesion in the right adrenal gland, suggesting metastasis. The possibility of thrombus was excluded, so the patient was treated by surgery, mass excision and replacement of ascending aorta and aortic arc. Then chemotherapy and radiotherapy, but he died of sepsis one month later. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon for another. Bye.